in this problem now, I have that this angle over here is 77 degrees, and based on that, I need to find angles x, y, and z again. So first, I'm going to know that uh, angle z and 77 are along a straight line. Therefore, there are supplementary angles that add up to 180. So I can set up that 180 is equal to 77 plus z. And then now, I can just subtract 77 from both sides. And if I do that, I'm going to get that z is equal to 103 degrees. So I can write that now. So I'm going to say that this angle over here is 103 degrees. What can I do now? Well, notice that uh, angle y over here and 103 degrees must be the same thing because they're drawn the same way. You have the line that comes down and goes to the right, and you have this line that comes down and then goes to the right in another parallel line. Therefore, 103 degrees and y are the same thing. So I know that this is 103 degrees. And finally, I know that x is 77 degrees. How do I know that? Where well, these are along a straight line. So 103 plus x equals 180 degrees. And that's the same thing as the situation up here. So just from that, I know that x must be 77 degrees. Another way that he could have come up with x is by realizing that 77 up here and single down there are alternate exterior angles, so they must be equal. So that's another way that you could realize that x is 77 degrees.